Bisphosphonates remain the optimal first-line treatment when it comes to treating osteoporosis and low bone mass in both men and women, according to an updated guideline published in Annals of Internal Medicine by the American College of Physicians. Current evidence suggests that increasing the duration of bisphosphonate therapy longer than three to five years reduced the risk of new vertebral fractures, but not other fractures. Osteoporosis is a disease where decreasing bone mass and deterioration of bone tissue leads to an increased risk for fragility and fracture. It's estimated that 10.2 million people 50 and older in the U.S. have osteoporosis. Bone fractures as a result of osteoporosis are associated with serious morbidity and mortality and people with prevalent bone fractures are at much higher risk of future fractures. This guideline will help clinicians determine the best course of treatment for their patients to best avoid bone fractures. Healthy lifestyle modifications and adherence to treatment, including exercise and counseling for evaluation and prevention of falls, were also part of the guideline. Adequate calcium and vitamin D intake should also be a part of fracture prevention in adults with low bone mass or osteoporosis. Doctors should also assess risks of fracture based on assessment of bone density, history of bone fractures, response to prior treatments, and risk factors for bone fractures. For more information, go to acponline.org.